The How-Tos of Being a Blockchain Developer in 2022 Did you know that the need for blockchain developers is increasing by 300 to 500% per year? There appears to be a lot of demand for blockchain developers. And the greatest thing, at least for developers, is that it's severely understaffed. There are many companies that require blockchain developers, yet there are simply not enough of them. I'm going to show you how to become a blockchain developer in 2022 in today's video. We'll discuss which programming languages you should be familiar with, what actions should be taken, what a blockchain developer is, and much more. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more related videos. Give this video a thumbs up, and then let's get going! Before we can discuss how to become a blockchain developer, we must first define what a blockchain developer is. Now, this might sound obvious to some of you, and others of you might be genuinely intrigued as to what this duty involves. So, I'd like to go through it with everyone to make sure we all understand what it's about. A blockchain developer earns a lot of money and is responsible for designing and building blockchain-based apps and solutions. There are currently a plethora of blockchain development options in areas in which you can specialize. We're not going to go over that today, but rather, the steps to take to get your foot in the door of being a blockchain developer. It's also worth noting that blockchain development and blockchain in general are frequently confused. Yes, Bitcoin is a big use for blockchain, but it's not the only one. Blockchain may store not only cryptocurrency transactions, but also data and other information. Healthcare is another field where blockchain technology could be beneficial if you want to keep hold of healthcare records and ensure they are unique. And some of these data concerning blockchain development blew my mind. I knew it was in high demand and that positions were expanding, but I didn't understand how much. These include blockchain developer, which has had a 33-fold growth in demand since 2020. It's also remarkable that blockchain is ranked first among the top 10 hard skills for 2020. According to a LinkedIn research, Many corporations are utilizing or will be adopting blockchain-based solutions to optimize processes, and it then discusses salary. However, this varies across company to company and location to location. According to this research, the average yearly income for a blockchain engineer in the United States is $136,000 followed by $87,000 in Asia and $73,000 in Europe. That could vary substantially depending on the organization you work for, your level of seniority, and other factors. But it gives you an idea of how much blockchain developers make and how in-demand they are. We now know what a blockchain developer is and how in-demand they are. But the next thing I want to draw your attention to is why blockchain is significant in the first place. We're constantly hearing about blockchain and these buzzwords, but what exactly does it do? How would this technology benefit us? Blockchain facilitates the verification and traceability of multi-step transactions that require verification and traceability. This means that any transaction that takes place must be validated as well as traceable, unique, and able to be completed. It simply follows each footprint it makes. Another advantage of blockchain technology is that it can assist with contract administration and product auditing. As a result, it resembles a fingerprint. It is both unique and traceable. That leads me to the question of what programming languages you'll need to become a blockchain developer. Of course, this will differ depending on whether you are already blocked or a developer, not a blockchain developer, versus you have no coding expertise and want to become one. Obviously, if you have no prior coding knowledge and want to become a blockchain developer, it will take longer, but it is certainly doable. Some of the programming languages you will need to be familiar with. 
The first includes Solidity, which should come as no surprise. Ethereum created Solidity, which is the first smart contract development language that is used to create smart contracts as well as various apps on a blockchain-based platform like Ethereum. If you wish to work as a blockchain developer, you'll need to learn this language. I have a few games that I enjoy learning, one of which was Space Doggo. Although it is a little out of date, I believe it is worth investigating. C++ is another popular programming language for blockchain developers. It's employed in a variety of blockchain initiatives, including the famed Bitcoin. C++, on the other hand, is useful not just for blockchain developers, but for any developer in general. It's one of those languages that has stood the test of time for so long. Python is another popular programming language among blockchain developers and it is now the world's second most widely used computer language. Essentially, it's incredibly popular and it isn't going anywhere, and Python, like C++, is one of those languages that can be used to so many different tasks that having those skills in general is beneficial. Then we go on to other topics, such as cryptography, which is essential to the blockchain. A public-private key is used in practically every process. You don't have to be an expert in cryptography anymore. You should, however, be familiar with the fundamentals of cryptography and simple algorithms. These are just a few languages. I'm not suggesting you learn them all. Far from it. Instead, gain knowledge of what is in demand and popular, and then decide where to begin from there. Right now, there are lots of excitement about it. And it's natural to wonder, is this going to be something that's here to stay or go away? I believe one of my favorite aspects of it is working on the tech side and learning about blockchain development, since that aspect is here to stay. When it comes to investment or cryptocurrencies, it can go up and down and about, and what you do with it is all up to you. But when it comes to blockchain development, that's not going away. And having these in-demand abilities is great. That is why I devote so much of my time to studying blockchain development. Finally, if you want to become a blockchain developer, start with Solidity and one of the tutorials that show you how to write a smart contract. It's basically no different from becoming any other developer after that. All you need to know is what tools are utilized and how to use them. I hope this video helped you understand what a blockchain developer is, why blockchain is important, as well as some of the most popular languages and courses available. Thank you all for watching! Please let us know what additional videos you want to see from us in the comments section, and I'll see you all soon!